parade box listed for this Friday. I have two Series 8 hit parade boxes right now. I can always order more, but let's get these two. Just want to get these in. Everybody seems to enjoy those, but I'm obviously more proud of my hit parade or my pick your player uh, boxes and selected jerseys. So um, hit parade a little bit more. <laughs> hit or hit or miss with the stuff that they have in there. So every series. Obviously, I have a I have another box number five of the uh, Waffle Board Pick Your Player Breaks listed for Sunday's break. So Friday we'll be doing the Hit Parade box, and then Sunday we have box number five of the Pick Your Player. Both of those that are right now on eBay. I haven't decided what I want to do for win next Wednesday. I don't know if I want to put another Waffle Board Pick Your Player break up or if I want to throw up the second Hit Parade box, but you know that you guys throw in your input for that, but I think I'd rather start working down into the 30s of these these uh, to pick your player boxes, so you know, the, the more we open, obviously, the closer that we get to the 30s. 43 right now. Just waiting to see if anybody else wants to stop by. Like I said, we'd like to get to the like to get the room viewers, you know, up so we get to the point where we can start doing some um, live fills, which would be great. I mean, that's that's the most fun, obviously, is to doing the live fills. But um, you know, obviously, with forty three boxes, we're still a bit above our viewership being able to claim all all 40, 42, 43 boxes, whatever it may be. So, um, I mean, I don't want to, you know, I don't want you guys to have to push to fill. You know, once we get into the thirties, it'd be a lot easier. I hope everybody's watching the games tonight. And even though those, those first two games are pretty much, you know, a, a, a blowouts by the, the top seeds, the, the the lower seeds have actually fought back today. They're both tied. Um, there's a Carolina is tied at three, and Florida and Boston, I believe, are still tied at two. So nice, nice to see the, the good series, you know, coming from both of those. Maybe, maybe the Islanders could steal one and Florida could steal one to head back to their homes. See if they can defend, you know, the whole serve on their home ice. But um, it's good to see. And I mean, the the, the lower seeds, obviously, the some of the lower seeds out west were winning. Obviously, the Kings beat beat Edmonton, which was nice. Obviously, to my my Tampa Bay beat Toronto yesterday. Uh, that was huge. Uh, the Rangers technically are on the dog. You know, they won at in Newark, I mean, in New Jersey, but living here, I know they're in Newark. So um, yeah, so it's nice to see the. Lower seeds come to play in the game ones of these playoff series. I think it's going to be a great, great anybody can win kind of, kind of playoff playoffs this year. Obviously, the Kraken won their first ever playoff game on the road at Colorado, which was the defending champions. That was great. You know, it's good to see these teams, um, the the lesser seeds, you know, at least at least make it a fighting chance. I mean, you don't want to see anybody get swept out of the first round unless it's the top seeds, and then you got to feel bad for those fan bases. But um. Yeah, we have two good series, two, two good games today. And then, obviously, later we have the Minnesota and Dallas. That was another lower seed. Minnesota won that. And then, obviously, the Kings play the, the Oilers. So, I hate to see, I hate to see McDavid get knocked out early, but yeah, it's you know, they, they haven't been able to build a winner in Edmonton. So, um, there's only so much he can do. Him and Dry Zotto are, are monsters, but they, need, they obviously need to have the rest of the team contribute. And the goaltender has been, you know, good and bad. You know, Campbell wasn't what they expected them to be, and Skinner is, you know, basically a rookie. So it's, you know, the, it's tough to throw that into his lap. Even though teams have won cups recently, with, you know, Bennington, you know, won the cup, and you know, so teams have made it to the, to the cup with young goalies. So it's not so much a, a stretch, but got to have the rest of the team in place. So let me see. What we got. We got. We got. People here, anybody want to say hi? What's everybody doing? Everybody's just showing up to watch. Nobody's chatting. Let's see how everybody's doing. Um, I'm in the process, you know, just to let you guys know, I'm in the process of using a um, break software so I can be able to put the the price list up on the screen as well as the as the uh, the random.org. You know, obviously like to have that on the screen so you guys can watch that um, as I 
instead of having to put up a tablet up to the camera. But um, you know, I do have a break software that I'm kind of fooling around with to try to get that um, ready for you guys. So, you know, like I said, anything to kind of make it more smooth. And obviously, this is all relatively new to me. I mean, I've been a tender of many breaks, but I haven't done many breaks myself. So we're only on the fourth box from the pick the player and we only did the three hit parade boxes. So um you know like I said I mean any input for you guys I I'm willing to appreciate it. if you guys want me to get cards at some point. I mean I would do you know limited edition hip parade cards. I'm like I'm not like I said hip parade hip parade you don't you know, doesn't make you money but it's it's more for the exposure and the viewership and the you know obviously I want you guys to to come here for your for your hockey breaks. I mean, I mean, there's lots of breakers that do everything else under the sun from, you know, the football helmets, the basketball, the, the baseball stuff. And, but I definitely would like to, to have this become, you know, one of your sources for hockey breaking. So it's, 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 I mean, if I have to grab some hip parade stuff, I wouldn't be a problem with that. So, you know, just let me know, you know, how, how interested you are in, you know, like I said, it just be like the, 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 the hip parade jerseys, you basically have the, you know, the 32 teams, well, there's no 33 with the, the cards because they're all on uh, NHL teams. But um, like I said, I'd get a box of hip rate here and there if, if you guys are really interested in doing that. But I'm not going to do it if you guys don't want it. So it's, 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 it's basically up to you guys to decide whether or not I got to start buying hip rate hockey boxes, limited edition boxes. But um, like I said, I mean, I mean you know, you, you're, you're, you know, I'm here for you guys. I mean, I you know, obviously I definitely want to, you know, make this fun. You know, I definitely want to start doing live fills at some point in time because I think that's that's the most interaction between between you guys and and me and and the the product. You know, being able to grab spots, you know, and and you know, chase players. So it's you know, it's 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 every it's baby steps basically trying to get down to lesser boxes so we can so we can get you know the the pure mayhem. Involving the 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 live fills. I know the Facebook live stuff. I mean, I was fake posting the list on Facebook and then have everybody claim in the thread that that rated for a while. Black label before we stopped. I think that's something that you know, I'm more. I'm very willing to to try, but I definitely want to make sure as you guys are are you either on Facebook. Everybody, not everybody's on Facebook, but I would like that to be an option for all of us to to start opening more boxes using the the Facebook. Fills and then obviously the more people start showing up for the breaks live, you know, you start doing live fills after the you know the eBay listing. So um, you know, I'm here, like I said, I'm here to do what you guys want want me to do. So it's 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 fun for all of us. You know, I definitely want you know you guys to get the rush of getting hits, and it's better to have you know a couple breaks per night than just the, the one box and done. So um, but like I said, that's why I probably want to double up with another um, pick your player break next Wednesday after the, the Sunday break, just like this week. So, um, so here we go. Let me see if I get the uh, 942. Definitely could break. Let me get my random.org up so we can figure out which box we're going to open. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Dice for now we're going to do, um, it's got to be, Five or better. Uh, so five or better. So we're going to roll two dice. Ten. So ten times we're going to random the lists. Okay. Okay, now it's 43 boxes. I took out um, number nine, which was the box that hit last time. So, you know, 25 and 27 and nine are now all missing from from the list. And we're going to random this 10 times. Okay. Do, do. Once. Twice. Three times. Four times. Five times. Six times. Seven times. One more. Box 46. You see that? It's kind of... Let's see that. Box 46 it is. <clears throat> oh. 
<laughs> Only at the bottom. Again. Okay. Box 46. Box 46. Box 46. Okay, here we go. It's going to be a winner for somebody. Oh, very nice jersey. Very good. That's a Cole Perfetti. That's the, uh, the Heritage. Cole Perfetti, AJCOA. Cole Perfetti signed in the gold, or signed in the silver ink. Let's get that open. Pretty jersey. I'm so happy to show this off, everybody. Here we go. Nice Adidas Cole Perfetti Heritage Classic patch on that. The heavyweight Winnipeg Jets Heritage Classic logo. Very good. 91. Had a nice rookie year. Looking forward to having big numbers with them soon. You know, we were losing some of their veterans, so you know, I mean, definitely a, a nice player to have going forward before he becomes a super duper star. Cobra Fetty. Good. Let's see who had that. Let me double check my list here. Okay. Cobra Fetty was one of our friends. Jason M, one of our Black Label veterans. Get, get. Jason M, congratulations. Jason M has been chasing a couple of the Jets, a couple of the other spots as well. So congratulations, Jason M. It's a nice Cole Perfetti. Glad you hit that. It's a really pretty jersey. So thank you much, guys. Thank you much. Like I said, I have uh, uh, the Hit Parade box up for Friday, and then we have another pick your player for Sunday. And then it looks like I'm probably going to list another pick your player for the following Wednesday. So a week from now, we'll have another one. So that's our fourth down. We're down to 42 boxes. So we're getting there. So um, hopefully we're getting to, getting closer to the to the lower boxes so you guys can chase your individual players and feel good about your odds. So 42 boxes left. Cole Perfetti is now gone. Real pretty jersey. Congratulations again to Jason M. Thank you, everybody, for attending. I can't do it without you. And I'm looking forward to seeing you guys on Friday night. Talk to you soon. Bye.